Good afternoon, folks. Big Bo here with another great back row bargains hybrid expandable value from Parkway RV Center. And who says camping has to break the bank, guys? We've got a very affordable travel trailer hybrid expandable we're going to review today. This is a 2002 Rockwood Roo. It is only $49.95, weighs about 2,300 pounds. We're just going to do a little quick walk around review of it. Not perfect, but overall this thing's in great shape and very affordable. I mean, you, you're you going to have a hard time finding a decent pop-up for what you can buy this camper for. And good thing about it, this thing's easy to set up. You know, 10, 15 minutes you're set up versus three times that long for a comparable pop-up. And looking around it, guys, it does have the aluminum frame. It does have the fiberglass exterior. You know, typical 2002 model issues. You've got some stripe peeling. Uh, it does have 30 amp electrical hookups. Of course, tires look great. It's got a uh, all your holding tanks, which is different than a pop-up. No porta potty in this one. You've actually got a full black water system. See the canvases to be 18 years old look great. Got a hitch on the back behind the spare tire so you can put a bicycle rack on it, put your little generator storage rack whatever you want to put on there does have a patio awning stabilizer jacks it is a double axle american flag going there boy beautiful day out here guys it's a model 21 by the way 21 feet sleeps a lot of people now guys just a quick reminder i'm just doing this on the fly so there's no power uh this unit is sold as is uh, anything in this price range, of course, we will hook power to it via generator or shore power. Let any interested party inspect it and see what works and what doesn't before they decide to buy. Because I have no idea what works and what doesn't. Um, so, in other words, you can check it out yourself when it's hooked into power before you buy it. So, let's look inside, guys. Floor looks great. Everything seems pretty solid. Now, at one time, this thing probably had a table right here, so it would make an extra bed. Uh, unfortunately, I'm selling it just like it is, so it's going to be sold without a table. You can always cut you a piece of wood to make that back into a bed if you want to. But as of right now, it sleeps five. But you can sleep seven if you put a piece of wood right there or made you another table. You got a queen bed. It's a front pop out. You know, looks good. It's got a little bit of... Like any hybrid, has got a little bit of mildew here and there on it. Nothing real bad on the canvas, but that's completely normal for an 18-year-old uh, canvas, just like a pop-up. Of course, you've got your sofa right here. Or this can make a table booth if you want to make a table for it. It'll be very easy to do. You can get those little pegs and just cut you a piece of wood, finish it up real nice, and, and uh, have you a nice table. Overhead AC, you know the... Uh, ceiling's not hanging down. I don't see any signs of leaks in here. Double basin sink. You've got a oven and stove top. Microwave, stereo, refrigerator that runs off propane or electric. You've got a single bunk back here with a ladder. And then, of course, all look at all this storage you get right here. A lot of storage in here for a small 21-foot camper. And it's 21-foot like it is right now that's a good thing about a hybrid camper when you're set up camping you're actually staying in a bigger camper than you're towing because the front and back pops out so you about you may be about 26 foot set up but you're only towing 21 so it makes it that much easier and this thing weighs what 27 2800 pounds if even that much 25 53 is what it weighs guys of course furnace Got a side enclosed bathroom, which makes it already unique to a pop-up. When I mean, you've actually got a real bathroom with a stand-up shower, um, you can see everything looks good. Not a bad little camper for $49.95. I mean, guys, believe me, uh, there's dealers out there that charge this much just in after-sales fees on top of the sales price for what we're charging for this entire camper. Got the... Uh, those are fans and lights that go into each bed. Those are almost always missing, but they're here in this one. Full bed in the back, clean in the front, bunk, and you can always modify this couch to make a 
pretty good size bed. Probably a uh, that's probably close to full to a queen size bed right there if you wanted to to make it that way. It's light, airy, no smoke, no pet odors. $49.95, guys. Haggle free, firm. I'm not taking a dime less for it. These things, you can't find these for this price. Guys, I can't find them. I know you can't find them that the ceiling ain't falling out of or the floor is so soft you step through it. I mean, this one right here is a solid hybrid for under $5,000. So don't expect this one to last very long. And, you know, a pretty day like this, what I like about a hybrid, and everybody's got their own version of camping. I've got mine, you've got yours, but it's something about being out here and, uh, like on a pretty day like this, a little bit of a breeze, you can unzip the canvas, you've got a screen to keep bugs out, and um, makes it nice for getting back to nature, being closer to nature. And I know that may not be for everyone, some people like the glamping better than the actual camping, but... To me, this is camping over staying in a, even though I own a motor home, but to me, it's just something nostalgic about staying in one of these. I used to own one many, many years ago and loved it, but of course, my wife has a different story. <laughs> but anyway, guys, thank you for watching my video. Uh, if you're interested in this little hybrid, it's on the Back Row Bargains page on our website, parkwayrvcenter.com. I'll put some links below in the video description so you can get a good idea of what we have. Uh, I'll have a, one to our free interactive tow guide, one to this particular unit on our website, and more. So if you're interested in this little camper, guys, give us a call, 706-965-7929. Call before coming to look to verify availability. It's not going to last long. Um... In time this thing goes through the thing and hits Craigslist and Facebook and eBay and everywhere else, this thing's going to be sold quick. Um, there's not many dealers. Out there, and let's be honest, guys, and I'll be completely honest with you. There's not any dealers out there that's got stuff for under $5,000, but we do. I've got this one. i got a little toy hauler fifth wheel. I've got a couple of pop-ups. Guys, I got all kind of, I've got several things for under five grand and a bunch under ten. And that's something you just don't find at your average used RV dealer or new RV dealer. Over 150, 60 plus used RVs and stock more arriving every day, guys. I mean, we're we're the real deal. We've been doing this for 52 years. Uh, we got a little bit of everything. No fees, no surprises. $49.95 sales tax. That's it. Easy, simple, done. We'll hook it to a generator, let you inspect it. Uh, just let us know you're coming so we can get one down here. And... Um, you can inspect it yourself before you decide to buy it. It's just, That's the easiest and fairest way I can think of to sell you this thing and keep the cost down where I can sell it for under five grand. You know, if you want to pay a few thousand dollars extra, we'll run it through the shop and do the full four-page service. But if you just want it for $49.95, I'll let you inspect it before you say yay or nay. And uh, you can pay for it, take it home with you that day. There's no need to wait on it to go through service. So, um... Thank you again for watching. Now, guys, just a quick thing. Um, yes, I'd normally have financing available, but unfortunately, $49.95 is under the threshold for all of my lenders. So if you want to borrow money on this, you've got two options. They're both going to involve you going to your bank. Go to your own bank or credit union, get a loan on the camper, or what I recommend doing, so you don't have to carry full coverage insurance on it if you don't want to, get a signature loan or personal loan for $5,000. I mean, it's so easy to do. Like my bank, I call up my loan officer, tell her what I want. If I want to borrow five grand or six grand or seven grand, she'll call me back 30 minutes to an hour later, says, hey, your check's ready. Come on in, sign up, get your check. It's that easy. Of course, I know not all banks are like mine, but, you know, your bank, you know, pretty much anybody can go get a $5,000 personal loan unless your credit's just really, really bad. So, but, you know, like I said, guys, we do not offer financing on anything under $6,000. It's not nothing against you. It's just we're at the mercy of the banks, and that's what the banks say. All my nationwide lenders say, got to be $6,000 and more. Or they're not, it's, not, they're, it's not worth them messing with. And I can't blame them. You know, they're used to doing, you know, forty, fifty, sixty, hundred thousand dollars dollars $100,000 RV loans. So. But anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Subscribe to my channel. More on the way, and nationwide deliveries available. We take trade-ins and look forward to seeing you here in beautiful Ringgold, Georgia.